Uh, yeah, hey guys, uh, good morning. Um, wow, something really, really important uh, and exciting hit me overnight. Um, you know, I've, I've, from a broad standpoint, I've been uh, wondering, you know, just can't help but constantly think, you know, you see the Casper online and uh, all those other online guys and then um, Mattress Firm and so on and so forth all over the place and blah, blah. Uh, and I can't help but wonder, you know, do we know 100% that we're going to be successful? And all of a sudden, uh, and it occurred to me because I fell asleep watching the movie The Founder um, about uh, Ray Kroc, the... Uh, well, he wasn't actually the founder, but the guy that eventually owned McDonald's. Um, great movie, by the way, if you, if you haven't seen it. Um, it's, he, he's a pretty wretched character, but um, it showed you what... It, it made me think of, of the following. Um, there's one way that you can absolutely 100% guarantee that you're going to be tremendously successful, not only in this business, but in any, in any business, but in particular, this one. Um, and that is to have a 100% commitment, drive, and dedication to being better at getting your message out to the public. Okay? Now, uh, we're going to do everything we can to compete and do great from a marketing and advertising standpoint. But ultimately, you know, Casper may end up having so many dollars that they do a great job advertising wise um, but if you will focus on being absolutely dedicated and commitment on a daily basis to first of all finding all of the little classified ad areas that you can and posting on them all the time um, you know we identified yesterday during our meeting um, you know here in Charleston I thought there were about six uh, former classified guys that all went out of business. Well, most of them did, but I found two of them that are operating and apparently being very successful uh, on Facebook Marketplace, OfferUp, um, and there's another one here, Low Country uh, Classifieds or something like that. Anyway, the point being, if you are committed to finding all of those little classified ad areas, places that you can post for free, getting your message out that way, so on and so forth. But here's another thing. Engage locally. Get involved with networking groups. Get involved with condo associations. Get out to apartment complexes. Get your flyers out to all of those places. Take your flyers to local businesses around yours. I was absolutely shocked. I mean shocked. There was a girl here locally that works for us that when we opened up the Windermere store, all she did was go around to the local businesses, talk to them all and say, hey, we're right over here. I can save you a ton of money on mattresses. Gave them all a flyer. Uh, had this little grand opening thing, blah, blah. I was shocked at the amount of business that, that came in as a result of that. Um, as I said, get, it, get involved with networking groups. Get involved with your condo associations and apartment complexes and, and constantly engage with those places. Uh, you can't just go one time and expect everybody's going to remember you. It's a, it's a matter of keeping your face, your name, and your message in front of people. Now, here's the way I know that this is going to win. We've got the best value. We've got the best product at the best price, and we've got the best customer experience. There's nobody out there that has a better customer experience than us. No haggling, no fuss, no, no bullshit, okay? That's what we're all about, no bull, all right? There's nobody that's got better prices than us, and there's nobody that's got as good of a, of a uh, customer experience. So all we have to do is get our message out to people. Well, we're going to do everything we can from an advertising and marketing standpoint to do that. But the one thing I know you can do while you're in your store, and by the way, the one way that you can virtually guarantee that eventually you're going to go out of business is if you're just sitting in your store hoping that somebody walks in that door. Um, that's the one recipe for potential failure. Now, we might be good enough at advertising and so on and so forth that even just sitting in your store doing nothing or just doing your, you know, regular stuff that you do, you can make it, you survive. But when you're really going to thrive is when you engage face to face with people. People will buy from you no matter what your price is. If they know you, they 
you know, they know where you are. Like, oh yeah, the mattress, it, uh, you know, Jim down the cool down the street, you know, Handy down in Clearwater. He's got. We gotta go see him. You remember, he's got that mattress store. Blah blah. So on and so forth. Keeping your face, keeping your name, keeping your message in front of people, and just flat out doing it better more often than the big guys because they're not doing any of that stuff they they're not they're not in your local area going to networking meetings and condo associations and apartment complexes and stuff like that they're relying on just zillions of dollars in advertising so you can either just sit in your store and hope somebody's going to walk in that door or you can actively be pursuing all of these you know apartment complexes networking groups uh, making sure you're in all the different classified ads, social media, making sure that you're, you know, pounding social media, getting your message out uh, with everybody, uh, keeping on top of what's the newest classified uh, thing. Doing that, if you get your message out better and you already have the best price and you already have the best customer experience, you, there's no way you can lose. You're, you're better than the other guys in every facet. The one thing we've been missing, apparently, here in the last year, is we've been relying on our pay-per-click and online presence and almost kind of sort of abandoning the face-to-face -face stuff and identifying the, the new classified ads. You know, when we got started in this business, all Jackie and I did is advertise in the classified ads. Not Craigslist, classified ads. And then... Uh, about nine years ago, uh, I'm guessing, our sales really, t 10 years ago, our sales really kind of topped out, or maybe 11 years ago, uh, and really started going down, started dipping a little bit, and I didn't know what the heck was going on, and uh, somebody mentioned something about this thing called Craigslist, and I'm like, what the heck is that, you know, I went on there and found these guys, holy cow, I had no idea, well, that was the advent of Craigslist, okay, there's now there's that's going away and there's new things uh, there's the uh, there's through Facebook obviously you've got Facebook marketplace then you've got Facebook you've got Craigslist through Facebook and the reason they did that is apparently people if, if you go on to Craigslist through your personal Facebook account by the way all this stuff has to be done on your personal Facebook account um, apparently Craigslist through Facebook weeds out a considerable amount of the scamming stuff. So people like going on Craigslist via Facebook because it weeds that, that junk out, the stuff they don't like. So engage there. Uh, engage on, on Facebook. Engage on uh, post on all of the free classified ads that you can find. Offer up uh, all of that kind of stuff. Uh, I'm going to put together a list of everything that... that uh, uh, that we have found so you can start getting on but get on and here's another thing that just drives me absolutely nuts people say well I don't know how how do I post on Facebook marketplace what is, what is that or how do I post on Craigslist through Facebook or I don't know how to do that well have you tried uh, have you gone on to uh, there's a offer up uh, I assume it's offerup.com you know Google it OfferUp.com. Well, look on the page. It'll probably say, create an account. Well, yeah, you need to create an account if you're going to post on OfferUp. Create an account and start posting. Um, there's no magic formula. All of these websites are designed for you to be able to, to operate on your own without instruction. It's not like you need to go to school to learn how to post on any of these things. They, they design it so that it's easy to do. So anybody can figure out how to do this stuff. You just got to do it. Uh, don't just sit in your store and hope that somebody comes through that door. <laughs> Make them come through the door. And you can do that. You just got to stay on these things and be dedicated, committed to doing a better job of engaging with people than the other mattress stores. You already got the best value. You already got the best customer experience. All you got to do is get your message out there. We're going to do everything we can from an advertising and marketing standpoint. But this... What I just described is foolproof. Can't lose. Absolutely can't lose. If you do a better job getting your, your message out there and you got a better price, you got a better customer experience, can't possibly lose. So get on this thing. Let's kick their ass. <laughs> Thanks. Have a great weekend, guys.